We are pleased to inform you that you've been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. Term begins September the 1st. Preliminary supplies have been collected at the Okay. Yippee ki yay. All right, let's see here. I want to look like. Meh. Meh. Looks good to me. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Ugh. Let's go down. A few cobwebs. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going. That was quite something. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. A few cobwebs and some dust. I am indeed a student. That was quite something. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. A few cobwebs and some dust. It was wonderful. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. <laughs> I kind of like it. That was quite something. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Will that get on my nerves during this? Will that get on my nerves if I play it like that? Gosh, damn it, I really want to. You know what? We're going with it. Gonna be a witch or a wizard. Um, We're gonna be a wizard. There we go. You know what? Hang on. I got it. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend this on spell casting. I presume you've been oh, practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, there we go. I'm quite sure I've never seen Sorry, anyone guys. take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the time begins. Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. His voice is paying off <laughs> already. I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Hmm? Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. <laughs> that voice Ages is already paying I've off. I swear to God. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Curious if I need to take the um, game volume down a little bit, maybe. Maybe we'll take it down this year a little bit. I won't know until I edit this video whether this game volume is good or not. So we'll see where we end up at here. Companion. A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. 
It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> She wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? <laughs> I don't voice. see a glow. I, it's, I, I don't know if they're going to get my nerves yet or not. Merlin's beard. H how did you... Wait. We do. Holy shit balls, man. Oh well. This guy's like, I'm bailing out. Grab it. Grab it, old man. Ah, damn. Ah, shit. What happened? Okay, I'm going to admit that I have seen all the Harry Potter movies. Not a huge Harry Potter fan, though. So I don't know all. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. I don't know all the terms, all the cool stuff, all the, you know, all the little uh, wand deals. My daughters made me watch uh, all of the Harry Potter movies before we went to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter in Orlando oh, here a couple years back. I can't believe it. And I'd never seen it before then. What and I haven't the seen it since. That damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir? <sighs> where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a <laughs> specific place. I'm feeling better, sir. If you'd like to look around a bit. I would, but stay close. Stay Make close. No who created this port key. All right, here oh, we go. Why? All right, so we're gonna move around. I'm just gonna check the check the moves here, right quick. Apparently, they ain't letting us do nothing yet. So, okay, let's go back and follow him. I think the voice choice I made for my character. Uh, was spot on, just so you know. I'm loving it so far. Oh, wow. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. 
We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you think... The port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right, and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Now, <clears throat> I am playing this on PC My with a controller. Um, and so that's why I... and my PC's acting weird as far as with the controller and this I have to hit my uh, alt tab in order for the controller to start working as I was going through trying to set up the game I kept hitting it I having to hit it to make the controller start working so anyways good question Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient Oh, now magic. I can jump. All right, just give me that. Yo. Ah, I almost ancient made it. Magic. Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost Yee. in time. <laughs> Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. Okay. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Oh, oh quit talking. That's the path down below. This way. She come to me. But okay. Sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why the powerful magic from the wizarding world spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one <laughs> who wields it. Okay, walk and run. Okay, got that. Oh, I about didn't make that jump right there. Yo, all right, give me my wand. I'm waiting for the wand. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Oh, there's my wand. Let's see I see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Okay. New spell unlocked. Oh. So I just gotta tap it, not hold it down. That's interesting. Okay, your arms, select an active target. Oh my god. Yeehaw. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Oh shut up, old man, let's go. Ah I got you. Your one works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. All right. Got it now. Yeehaw. Whoa. I'll take it. I'll get that pot right there. You don't worry about it. Wait, I got that pot up there, too. Ah, up there. And that one. Those dangerous ass pots. We'll just kill every one of them. Hang on. There's gotta be something over here, right? And then, aha, uh -huh, see? That'll give you an area in the, the frick did I get from there? I gotta figure out where it tells you what you get from, can I get over there? Nope. Okay. Boom pot, boom pot. We're close now, it's just Boom ahead. pot. <laughs> Steady yourself. Yeah, okay. Reparo.
I like how when they cast a spell, this being a novice, uh, freaking Harry Potter person, everything they say is something to do with what's going on. Like, you know, uh, if they're going to take a bath, they say, oh, batho. <laughs> and it draws, the one draws a bath. Them gosh damn dangerous pots. I'm going to take care of every one of them. Thought I missed that, didn't you? I got it. Oh, trying to sneak up on me, I see. Oh. Alright. What'd he say? I don't want to listen to him at all. Any map shows you surroundings with one in the middle. Okay. I got it. Oh, sneaky pot. Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Hmm, perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. <sighs> yeah, okay. Ha. Ha. Oh. Professor, this statue. This may have been his home. Oh, wow. Well, this be a hell of a home. Gosh, damn pots. Sneaking up on me everywhere. Okay, I'm gonna quit. I'm gonna quit killing pots now. I can't help it, though. I can't help it. That enchanted crystallized stone again. Yeah, okay. But what could it be blocking? Let me look where I want to look. Don't control the camera. What's this? Professor Fig! What the hell is this? Dude, are you like slow or whatever? Come on. How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. I wonder if I can change my voice. Like if I get sick of hearing my character talk like it's talking, if I can change it. Godric's heart. The hell? Where are we? I I'll turn my head for a minute. Okay, I guess they ain't gonna let us walk anywhere except for right here. Hello? Nice. Yeah. <clears throat> it can't be. Just a moment. <laughs> Ooh. I have a feeling this is going to be some bullshit right here. After you. Okay. Now keep your hands inside the cart if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, come on. How many volts are there in the Hundreds. 
In fact, you know, see quite a few on our way to vote we went to uh, we speak, the we Wizarding World of Harry Potter in Orlando and rode every ride down there except the for this one. This is the only ride we didn't get to ride because the line was wrapped around the whole park. Which, when we was down there, the the, uh, the new bike roller coaster they put in for uh, whatever the guy's name is um, wasn't there. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? So Hogwarts, is that his name? I can't remember. Anyways, his motorcycle Box ride. Number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Could you imagine riding on that down through a cave? Vault number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. No seat belts. Rare anyone goes there anymore. If you fall off, good luck. It's a long day. Yeah. Here we are. When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Well. Vault 12, thank you for your help. I guess we're going into this uh, shit that ain't been looked at and I don't what know do how long. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Well. Best of luck. <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. No shit. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Steady your wand with L and then guide it along the symbol. Learn the path. Press corresponding input when prompted to accelerate your wand. Okay. Well, I sucked at that. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw in the portkey container. 
If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Okay. If you say so. Lumos. Lumos. I gotta learn that. This is no How do you do that? Vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Well. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. I need a Lumos. I, I need that. Uh, how do you do it? Just, uh, just give me a little hint. Just tell me. You make an L in the air and say, uh, light up, ayo. <laughs> All right, let's see, I see here. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue. What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Oh, there he is again. So... There must be something to that reflection you're seeing. It says I don't want to... Like, Try casting Revelio, perhaps. Well, let's just do that bullshit. Well, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. Well, I mean, I'm pretty happy to cast Lumos, but are you that damn lazy? Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Aha! Son of a butt. Wait, what happened? Oh, you... There you go. The hell? Oh, shinaki taki. We're gonna fight all these guys. Oh, God. Ah. Well. Uh, wine coming in attacks. Okay, I got that. Okay. Got me. I'm throwing it under my legs. I'm doing all kinds of bullshit here. All right, mother frickers. Oh god, I missed it. I missed it. I felt it, but I missed it. Review the way forward. Oh, 
Ah, <laughs> see, I got it that time. Okay, we're, we're these things just keep coming. All of them. Stay close. Oh, sorry, sorry. Here, here. Sorry, I'm I'm up on you. Professor, Professor Fink. Well, you Professor, disappearing you? son of a bitch. This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? What's uh, happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Hey. Revelio. Lumos. I see one right here. Revelio. Oh, that's where they're leading me. I well, I'm not going there yet. Forget that. I'm going to get some magic chests. Stuff. Let's do one more over Velio. Make sure they Okay. Lumos. Boom. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. You got her, well, we're gonna take them out. Okay, so um Oh shit, I got to do 3 of them. Are you kidding me? I need to align these statues with their reflections. You're kidding. Boom. Ah, oh, son. Okay, so what now? Wait. Perhaps I need to get them all to stand at once. Oh, I gotta stand right here. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. I didn't do it. Boom, you dead. Okay, I got you. Oh, you son of a bitch. What? I'm hitting why? Oh my god, dude. Alright, dude. This is some bullshit. I just want you to know. This is some bullshit. I'm hitting why and it's not doing what I want it to do.
<laughs> I get stupid fly. You son of a bitch. I don't know why the shit, when I was hitting Y, it wouldn't do that. But, that's what it is. Okay. Lumos. I don't know what the hell is going on there. for viewing memories. I wonder... Too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. <clears throat> That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We will... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. 
Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you did terrible. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Holy crap balls. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. <laughs> I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony?
Phineas Nigellus Black. Prepare yourself to meet the Headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. I remember this. I remember the uh, courtroom eating uh Professor Weasley we've one more to be sorted welcome you're just in time have a seat all right now I'm going to Slytherin that's what I mean if they pick it first then great but if ah. not a bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Mm. I wonder... Mm. I detect something in you. <laughs> a certain sense of... Mm. What is it? He's enjoying this way too much. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition. An eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. There you go. Boom. Accepting it. You belong in Slytherin! That's right, because green's my favorite color. One more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Ah, boo. Shit. Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I want done eating. What the hell? Do I not get no food? Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As deputy head, <laughs> I have not hit puberty yet. It's a distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. It can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. 
Very well. Aspiration. I'm not a big fan of snakes, but I get it. I get it. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Oh, shit. Oh, looks like frame drop. That's some major frame drop right there. 